keeps trying to steal her birthday cake. And look at that. It is swollen. Oh, it's in Chicago. They gave our hotel rooms away after we called them twice today. Good afternoon, guys. So we are well on our way to Indiana. We're about an hour away from our destination, right? Yeah. And almost to Missy's birthday party. All right, guys. So we are entering the Chicagoland area to get to Indiana. And I despise this traffic. Like, this makes me so nervous. You so want to drive nervous. this big thing? No. I like, literally, I'm hitting the brake pedal half the time while Matt's driving, but there's no brake pedal there, but I'm still doing it. It stresses me out. All right, so you remember I said I'm really, I do, I get like really nervous in the Chicagoland area traffic, any heavy traffic really. I just don't like to drive in it at all. And so we just had, we're in this like kind of congested area and just had this semi like whip out in front of us. And I'm like, oh, and then he did it again. And then went off the road. And then went off the road. And finally, yeah, that's and just one of those moments where. It's another one of their company in front of us. <laughs> it's becoming such a safety issue that. You almost have to call it in because it wasn't just us, it's like other people on the road and this guy's just like whipping it around. He puts his blinker on and it was like, okay, I turned on my blinker. Let's just go where I'm going now without even looking to see if anything's there. Oh, I hate this traffic. So we got stuck in some really, oh, really congested traffic. Of and we were trying to figure out why because it was like all of a sudden and really abrupt Matt had to slam on the brakes because like traffic was moving at a really good clip and then all of a sudden it just wasn't and it looks like there's an accident up ahead and that would be why definitely so. because there's three patrol that went past us already yeah. and I could see the flashing lights up here oh and it's a U-Haul U-Haul's been having a bad couple of days at our hotel instead of the park where we we're supposed to go but I wanted to show it to you anyway it's super pretty we've stayed here before we stayed here when Missy and Phil got married so I gotta show you this because it's just gorgeous look at that isn't that neat it's just so right, pretty. guys there's our birthday girl that we've been talking about we were gonna come up and see <laughs> I told you she was having a Batman theme party let's see this cake it's not put together yet. Oh, I gotta wait. You can't see the cake. No cake reveal yet. But look at it, guys. Look at that food. It is so good. Mm, there should be taste division. Taste division. Taste division. Taste division. And you know where the kids are? Over there, hanging out at the awesome park. All right, Braxton. Let's see the Batman shirt. Did your Aunt Missy send you this shirt? You look so. amazing. Did you tell her thank you? Thank you. Cool cake, you guys. Can you can you eat it? Not yet. Not yet. In a little bit, okay. You can go play until it's ready. Yeah, we have to sing Happy Birthday to me. I just see him laugh. Your your child laughed at me because he has to sing Happy Birthday to me. 
Yeah, now we gotta have Missy in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah
months ago. They put that in three months ago, stipulation that we <laughs> needed the adjoining rooms. This morning I called them and I said, do you need us to come there first or go to the party? No, that's fine. I messed up the GPS, took us to the hotel first anyways. So we got there first, we stood in their lobby for over 20 minutes and no worker showed up. So we left to go to the party, I then called them, they said no, that's fine. We got there and they said, oh, we don't have them rooms available. Yeah, and so we did call around and we tried to find hotel rooms. There's some sort of event I'll going on. And so most of them are booked. Books. And the other ones are requiring our size of family to have three rooms, which is just beyond our budget. I mean, that's just too much. And it wouldn't do anything for us anyway, because we'd still be kind of stuck in the same situation. So we're headed home, guys. No. Anyway, we'll see you tomorrow. And like I said, grouchy kids. They're very disappointed. We're